Hello, Bill Carroll for Zinni 62 Media, and of course, as anyone who cares even a little bit about American tackle football professional level knows, <clears throat> that DeAndre Rashawn New Hopkins is now going to be a Tennessee Titan. Now, what does that mean? While he's going to increase the quality and the depth and, of course, the reliability of the targets they have in the passing game, does he radically change the outlook of the Titans on offense? I think people are getting a little too excited. They had 3,227 yards passing last year, and I think that number actually dipped a little bit this year, quite frankly. I think that they're going to convert uh, on third down at a slightly higher rate. They were towards the bottom of the league last year in uh, completion percent, not completion percent, well, they, were, they weren't great in that either, but uh, in um, converting on third downs, they were 36.5% last year. I expect that number to maybe trend up slightly higher, but not dramatically higher. And here's what I want to really want to hit on. He's not going to, he was not and has not recently been a big play type receiver. You have to go back a few years, several years in his career. He's not going to suddenly go back to being a dominant receiver. He's going to be a really good receiver. My projection is about 828 yards receiving on probably right around, you know, um, over or under. Uh, my guess would be around 49 on the low end to maybe 60, 667 on the high end. And like I said, my guess is about 128 yards receiving. Worst case scenario, about 760. Best case scenario, maybe he gets close to 900, maybe slightly over 900. But I'm thinking about five touchdown receptions and probably, you know, red zone targets. He is a reliable target. He is still a guy who manages to work his way open even when he's, you know, whether it be zone versus man, he's a smart player. But he's not a dominant player. He's not a guy that tremendously, dramatically changes the complexion of an offense. And once again, in terms of passing yards per game, just as a reminder, last year they were 30th out of 32 teams. I think they will trend slightly upward. I think that, but not way upward. Actually, I think the numbers would be probably right around there, actually, when I think about it. I don't think they'll get above, I think best case scenario for them is probably about 203, 4, maybe 212, right? So maybe 212 yards passing per game, which means a 1,000-yard season, probably even a 900-yard season, is probably out of the question for DeAndre New Hopkins. But will he help? Is he a better player than some of the players they ran out there at wide receiver? Yes. No one, I think, is even bothering to dispute that. But is he going to dramatically reshape the offensive fortunes of the team? I just don't see that. So, once again, Bill Carroll for Zinni 62 Media. I'm also going to be breaking down a few other things that are happening as we make our way into training camp. See you soon.